let me be clear about this. As you know, all students are allowed to put up notices in the school with all sorts of information which may be of interest to other students. And I must say, some of you take great care to produce really artistic notices. Now, the school rule on notices is clear. They may be displayed only on notice boards provided by the school. And any notices placed anywhere else will be immediately removed. So, here's your room key, and I've got your passport details. Now, what about parking? My car's just outside the hotel at the moment, so I'll have to move it. Would it be all right to leave it in the market square overnight? You could do that, but I wouldn't recommend it. We have our own garage under the hotel. It's just five euros a night. We'll park it there for you if you like. Oh, great. Uh, here are the keys. I've already taken all my luggage out. The product I'm going to review this week is a digital camera, the Roxel DX15. It's hard to criticize a camera you can buy for $110, a real bargain for anyone. You simply can't expect greatness in all features at that price. A low price model will probably be fantastic in some areas, and it does look stylish, but other things will have to be lacking. This is certainly true with the DX15. The body of the Roxel DX15 measures 91 millimeters wide by 56 millimeters high. It's 28 millimeters deep and weighs 128 grams, so it fits easily in a pocket or a small bag. Its silver body is a combination of metal and plastic. It's strong enough not to get damaged from being banged around in a bag, so it's great for keeping with you in case of unexpected photo opportunities. The only problem is the design of the little door on the bottom of the camera, which covers the rechargeable battery and memory card. It slides open a little too easily, even sometimes while you're taking photos with the camera. It's also very easy to put the battery in incorrectly because it's not clear which way round it should go. All the camera control buttons and dials are on the back of the camera. The dials are small but turn easily and they don't move when you're pulling the camera out of your pocket. However, all the buttons are really tiny and sometimes need to be pressed more than once because of this. Let me talk about the camera functions. Finding your way around the menu system is extremely simple. It has no standard functions and the added advantage of face detection. That's where the camera finds faces in a picture and adjusts itself to the best settings for the faces. And this function works quickly and accurately. But we think users will miss having guidelines for photograph composition not available on this model. Picture quality is about what we expected for this camera. It's definitely better than the cameras you get on phones, but it's certainly not great. In all conditions, the photos it takes lack sharpness and detail. Colors and white balance are satisfactory, though it has some problems in the blues. In conclusion, the Roxel DX15 is relatively cheap and easy to use, making it a reasonable choice for those who want something of average quality that doesn't cost too much. However, if you can afford a little more, the Roxel D120 is a much better choice with improved picture quality and performance. Those who don't mind a bigger camera could also take a look at the Proto P10, which costs about the same as the DX15.
Part 2, Use of Language and Reading Sentence Completion Click on the gap then choose the word or phrase which best completes the sentence. James made a great to arrive on time. A. Try. B. Struggle. C. Aim. D. Effort. Multiple choice gap fill. Click on each gap then choose the word or phrase which you think fits best. Birth of the movies. Moving pictures were invented by the brothers Louis and Auguste Lumiere at the end of the 19th century. Movies vary. Became popular all over the world. In 1907 the first studios were built in A. of Los Angeles called Hollywood. It was the perfect place, close to many kinds of natural scenery. The 1920s, Hollywood was the center of the world film. To begin with, the movies had no sound words on screen from time to time to explain the story 1 a quickly b immediately c fast d early 2 a peace b sight c location d district 3 a 2 b at C 4 D by 4 A industry B company C trade D firm 5 A developed B happened C appeared D displayed Open gap fill. For these questions, type the correct answer in each gap. Type only one word in each gap. To, Silvio. From, Lars. Hi Silvio. There's. To be an extra swimming competition next week and not. People in the team. Free to do it. Jane. You to swim in six races. Is that. Much swimming for you? What do you think? Lars. Read and select, short reading text for this question, choose the correct answer. From, Sarah. To, David. Dear David. Hi. The attached picture shows the bridge over the dry river valley I can see from my hotel room, though the hotel's actually a 20-minute walk uphill from the bridge. Sarah. A. Sarah's hotel looks over a river. B. Sarah's hotel is by a bridge. C. Sarah's hotel is on a hillside. Making a career in music Are you desperate to have a music career? First off, remember this, no one really knows who's going to get to the top. All those talent scouts, those so-called star makers, are just guessing. So go into your music career knowing that there's no mystery ingredient. What you need is confidence, an appreciation of a good tune, luck and lots of charm. 1. The first paragraph says that anyone who wants a career in music A is fortunate if they are discovered by talent scouts. B. Must have self-assurance and an appealing personality. C. Will only get to the top if they have exceptional musical skill. In a market where there's room for songs of every kind, you have a chance of selling your music. The trick is to present yourself as the only person with a particular style or talent. And why not be a bit boastful about it? Don't be shy about networking with all sorts of people, it's surprising who can help you. Start by playing your music to the owners of local music clubs. 2. How are musicians advised to market themselves? A. They should have a wide variety of songs to perform. B. They should show that they are different from other musicians. C. They should only contact people they know will be useful to them. Prepare for poverty, you probably won't be partying with the stars for a while. Get a job, or even several jobs. Best of all, 
seek out music-related work. You can play at wedding parties, give music instruction, or write songs to advertise businesses on local radio. This way, you get that added bit of musical experience to boast about at your first audition or interview. 3. While musicians are waiting for their career to start, they should a find work that will help them in their profession. b improve their skills by having music lessons. c learn how to make a good impression at an audition. Be professional. Take a look at your website. If it looks horrible, then it's time to rethink the design. Make it attractive, but accessible. It must be straightforward for people to find their way around the site or they'll lose interest. A record deal is no longer necessarily the first goal these days. You can build an audience online first, and then the big recording labels might take notice. 4. What advice is given to musicians concerning their websites? A. The website should be designed so it attracts music companies. B. An expert should be hired to design an attractive website. C. The website should be easy to use. Investigate all sales options. You can sell CDs through local gift shops, bookstores or a heap of other outlets. Who knows, companies in your neighborhood may even agree to sponsor small tours or concerts you arrange. Be inventive and try your hand at playing in streets or marketplaces, to get your music heard. Five. Regarding sales, the fifth paragraph suggests that musicians could a ask local businesses to support events they organize. b offer discounts to local shops. c sell tickets to their concerts in streets and marketplaces. Consider learning about the music business by getting a job with a music company for a while. The industry is dominated by a few major companies. Choose a record label you like and then contact the company asking if they will take you on, unpaid, for a few weeks work experience. Ask them very nicely and be as polite as you know how. Make sure you enthuse about their music and show a deep knowledge of their artists. If they agree, that will be a step towards your goal. 6. What does the final paragraph say about working for music companies? A. The companies do not pay much money to part-time workers. B. Musicians have to be respectful towards the companies. C. Employees have opportunities for meeting artists, 